Hi guys and welcome back to some more Game of Thrones and we're going to play episode 3 and there's going to be dragons. There's going to be dragons. I'm so excited. We get to see dragons. So let's begin episode 3. Dracarys. Dracarys. I'm not sure how you say it. Dracarys. Dracarys. As usual, I will say it always I can think of in the hopes that at least, on Game of Thrones. at least once I'll nail it. Anyway, previously on Game of Thrones. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of 20 men within your walls. You have a man you trust? My son, Griff. I suppose the Crown could be persuaded to secure Ironwood from House Forrester. Lady Marjorie might not look favorably on such an alliance, and it would infuriate Cersei. Although, what would be amusing for me might prove rather dangerous for you and your house. Father, I'm going to kill you. Is that so? I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. Who the fuck is he? My uncle. Roderick? Roderick, by the gods, it is you! Sir? Fetch the maester! Hurry! Fetch the maester! <laughs> Let her go! <laughs> <laughs> The Lost Legion won't stop until you and your friend are dead. Um, I think the game has froze. Okay, no, it seems to be working. But anyway, that's just your typical Tuesday in Westeros, apparently. She's been gone a while. She'll come back. If they catch her, they'll kill her. They won't catch her. She's costing us time. It's just the... We need to get to Marine. Every day we lose here is a day that Talia or Ryan could be hurt, or, or, or worse. You must return home safely, Asher, and, well, you, you have a history of putting your faith in women who may not deserve it. Excuse me? Ah, uh, Beshka is my friend. Beska is my friend. She's my friend, uncle. She's been at my side for a long time. Was it them? The Lost Legion. Aye. Too many for us to take. I counted about two dozen, maybe more, as well as horses. About half a mile down the canyon, and coming fast. Had to run my ass off to avoid getting caught. <laughs> it's nearly empty. You two care if I finish it off? It might be a while before we find more water. Ah, uh, you deserve it. Dying, though. Nah. Drink up. Thanks. Yeah, I'm happy with that decision. Right. We need to get moving. I trust her. I do trust her. The Lost Legion. We're a hundred miles from Yunkai. When are they going to give up? You really should have killed Tazar when you had the chance. Men like that don't forgive. You cut off his hand. I'm not a monster. I think a person forgets about another person. He was defenseless. I didn't see a need to shed more blood. And how's that working out for you at the moment? It's only a matter of time before they overtake us. Ah, bugger a harpy. Can we double back? Not without meeting dear old Tazal. Can we claim? We're well and truly fucked this time, Asha. 
During severe winters, when the Skahazadan floods, it carves out great underground rivers in the sandstone. And? And when those waters recede, those rivers become caves. And those caves might hide us, if we can find them. All right, that sounds like a smarter moment, idea than I was thinking. All I'm saying is we uh, need to die here, just standing our ground. Thank you, Malcolm. That's valuable advice. Of course. If he's right about this, I may actually stab him. That's not particularly nice, but okay. So, yes, episode three, Game of Thrones again. I am, like, approaching this series with such fresh enthusiasm since I finally got around to watching the latest season of Game of Thrones. Um, or at least the latest, I'm saying, like, season four. And I finally started to read the books as well. So I... Well, we can't stay here. Waiting for your butchered friends to call us. Excuse me, Malcolm. Agreed. I was talking. So I'm finally starting to what understand think? what's going on a little bit. Out of it? Pretty steep, Asha. And we'd be totally exposed if your friends arrived before we reached the top. I know that this is actually set just after season three, but I feel like watching season four gave me a little bit more of an understanding and uh, remembering basically what had happened. <laughs> It's not gonna happen. It's too unstable. Well, the claiming idea was a it was an idea, at least. Do you think we could dig our way through? Or try to scramble over? I don't know. Either will be slow and tricky. One wrong move and the whole thing could collapse on us. Um I can't, like, find anything else I'm supposed to look at unless I talk to them. What in seven hells did you two do to rile these bastards so badly anyway? Well, back when I... You found anything? <sighs> Not yet. What's on your mind? Kind of wish I heard the rest of that, uh, story. How'd you know about the caves? How do you know all that? About the floods and the caves? I read all about Essos on the voyage over. Histories of marine, histories of Slaver's Bay. I just hope it pays off. Uh, Beska risked her life for us. You see, Beska came back. She risked her life out there for us. You trust her now? This may sound harsh, but Beska's immaterial. I have to put you first. You are all that matters to me, Asha. Beska matters to me. Uh, we'll all need to work together. We all need to pull together if we're going to get out of this and onto Marie. I can't have you and Beska scrapping. So much riding on this. Talia, Ryan, your mother. You and I are supposed to return to Westeros with a sellsword army, and I have the faintest idea how we're going to pull it off. So, if I seem a bit moody, that's why. Fair enough. Let me know if you find anything. Also, I want to apologise if you'll hear my family in the background. I know my dog was barking earlier. They're, uh... Rock slide looks recent. They're getting ready to go out, the so there might be a little bit of noise. Hey, Beska. Uh, do you know any more about the Lost Legion? Do you know anything else about these bastards hunting us? Well, obviously they hate you. Thanks. I figured that out on my own. You've heard the rumour, right? They carve their faces up as an initiation. Flay the skin right off. Looks like they're inside out. That's why they wear those helmets. Pfft. No. That's a load of horse shit. <laughs> he doesn't look so sure. Um, Malcolm's not so bad. Look, Malcolm's all right. I promise. Yeah, he practically raised me. You know my father and I didn't get along. Well... He's an odd one, and he doesn't appear to like me much. He has a lot of things on his mind. The right things, I hope. Thanks for coming with us, by the way. I meant to say, thank you. I realise this isn't your fight, and Marine is the last place you'd want to go. God, Sasha, don't go soft on me. Together till we're dead. Aye. Beska, if you see anything. Okay, T 
time to get serious, time to look around, time to find whatever the hell I need to do to get the hell out of this place. So he was talking about Daenerys, so I wonder if it's through, well, I'm not, I don't wonder. Um, I'm assuming it's through these characters will meet Daenerys and the dragons. Oh, there's a corpse. Hey, dead body. Looks like we're not alone. No oh. obvious wounds. Maybe he died of thirst. Listen. That's water. I hear water. From underground. There might be a cave nearby. Uh, let's search the corpse. Look at this. Gold. Fat lot of good it did him. And there's a cave behind there. So, what, was he guarding the cave? Why would he be out here if there's a cave there? Uh, should we take the gold? That's a nice purse of gold. Wonder who he was, carrying that kind of money out here. Let's not worry about that now. We need to find cover. No, I'm just suspicious of what he's doing out there when the cave is here, and why he's carrying gold. He's not gonna need that. Asher, the Lost Legion will be here at any moment. Alright, alright, I hear ya. There's always time for gold. Let's go. Oh shit. Oh. It's them. Monte Bredom! Kesirizzi! Shit! Come on! Okay, move forward. Go, go. I'm behind us. Damn it! Sir, sort of, another way out of here. Got it. Yeah, we've sort of blocked ourselves in. Uh, let me just adjust the volume for me a slight touch. It's a bit too loud for me. Okay. Um. What seven hells is that smell? Got some carcasses. I guess what this used to be. I I don't know either, to be honest. Uh. So there's not not much point in me guessing. Ah. Esther, how come? We encountered a dragon quicker than I thought. Nope. Easy now. What a treat. I'm not going to fend off a dragon. I guess I'm gonna fend off a dragon. Glad to know my choice mattered. Dragon, if I were you. Man, Daenerys is gonna be pissed. Man, Daenerys is gonna be pissed actually if she catches us. Oh no! I pressed the wrong button at first, I think. And I panicked for a second. Oh, okay. That looked like it hurt. That also looked like a heart. Oh my god. Oh my god. Seriously? Malcolm or Beska? Malcolm is like a dad to me. Oh my god. Shit. I can't believe it forced me to make this decision so early on. I'm going with... Get out of my way. Hurry! Be 
Beast is coming around. Asha! Take my arm. Come on, Bester. Come on, come on, come on, come on. The beast is coming. I love Beska, I do, but my choice there was based on the line that he said that um, Malcolm is like a father to him. So to me, it was like really, really important. Like, okay, well, I think he would save the guy that he said is like a father to him. He's, but then I don't know. Like, I don't know these characters well enough just yet for me to think who was he more likely to save in that scenario or what I've been playing him like because he is close to Beska. He was obviously defending Beska. Um, to Malcolm earlier, so I don't know. It was a really, really tricky decision, and I really hope I made the right decision. And I'm scared that I've made the wrong decision. And also, you can tell that I'm doing my best to talk over the credits so I don't get a content ID match. And I'm pretty sure I'm still going to get one, which is why I'm just going to keep talking about my decision that I made, which I felt I I think I made the right decision because it seems like Beska is still with us, even though she is struggling to walk. So that's going to make it a little bit trickier to try and get away from the Lost Legion. But I'm wondering now if we're going to encounter Daenerys because obviously the dragons are there, they must be close by. Anyway, Game of Thrones, yes. Episode 3, The Sword in the Darkness. Listen up, you sorry lot. Gather round. We're handing out assignments today. Garrett, <laughs> we'll be men of the watch before nightfall. Right. Sorry. No hard feelings over that business with Finn, yeah? I appreciate you not ratting me out over the knife. It's nice to know there's at least one brother I can trust. Finn might have killed me otherwise. That's what friends I wouldn't do. be much of a friend if I did. I wasn't much of a friend for dropping you into the mess in the first place. Sorry about that. It won't happen again. Well, aren't you two sons of whores looking thick as thieves? Having a good laugh over nicking my knife, eh, Garrett? Men like you turn traitor for nothing. It's in your blood. Stop being a jerk. You'll be killing men of the watch for a loaf of bread. Finn, stop being such a bloody fool. When a man takes my gear, it'll be my fist that'll rip their heart from their gullets. You'll always be an asshole, Garrett. Enough already. Oh, would you let it go? I've had enough of your shit, Finn. Fuck off, Garrett. Finn, leave him alone. It wasn't Garrett's fault. If you're gonna hate someone, hate me. With pleasure. Now, it doesn't matter what the world once called you. After today, you're all brothers. Could even be that the man standing next to you saves your life one day. Or maybe you'll save his. Let's find out then, shall we? Casper to the builders. Finn to the rangers. Eric to the stewards. Hugh to the rangers. Cotter to the builders. And finally, Garrett to the Rangers. That's it. May all the gods preserve you. All right, well, then. There we are. I'll be patching up the wall, and you'll be defending it. Should you northern boys want your gods to give a blessing to this union, there's a weirwood tree beyond the wall. Now form up and follow my lead. <laughs> 